Make sure you select a colour for the background that's totally different from the design element so it stands out. This makes removing the background easier. Since I've got green, pink, yellow and white elements, I'll go with a black background. When you've done that, save the design. Use Photoshop, or if you don't have that, use Photopea, which is free. Open the design from Canva. Create a new layer by clicking this button at the bottom. Then drag the layer under your Canva design. This will stop your background getting auto-filled when you delete it. Now go to Select and click Color Range. You can click on the canvas to select the color you want to remove. It'll be reflected in this preview window. So if I click a yellow star, you can see all the yellow elements have been selected. We want the background to go, so click any black area. Adjust the fuzziness to the maximum amount to make sure all the background color gets removed. When you press OK, it'll just select the black background. Press delete and it'll disappear. Here's an optional bonus tip if you want your design to pop. Go to layer, then layer style, then stroke. Increase the size to whatever outline you like and press OK. If you decide that you don't want that anymore, just click the eye icon down here and it'll hide it. When you're happy with your design, make sure you save it as a PNG file so the transparency remains there and you're good to go. If you found this helpful, give this video a like and maybe check out my tutorial about 5 ways to design without design skills. Don't forget to subscribe for more useful tips. Cheers. Thank you.